Hey there, I hope you're doing well. This is the first video that I'm sitting down to film and the first video that I will be sharing on my YouTube channel in 2021. So happy new year. I know the new year is off to a crazy start already, but I hope that you personally are doing really well. After Vlogmas, I took a little bit of a break to kind of get my house back together. I took all the Christmas stuff down. I'm still slowly getting things organized, decluttered, all of that. I really do want to share some of that process with you guys, but sometimes I just need to get it done and I don't want to have to worry about setting up the camera and doing all of that. So I have been slowly working through my house. I spent some time with my mom and little brother's room. We got his room completely done. It looks really great. If you guys want to see a nursery tour, let me know in the comment section below. So that's what I've been up to. I have been sharing a lot on my Instagram, so make sure to follow me over there. I'm also on TikTok quite often. I love TikTok. I think it's my new favorite app. So check me out over there. You can also uh, uh, check out my blog and all of that. All the links are always in the description box below. But today I am sitting down to share with you a Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret semi-annual sale haul. I have had these bags sitting in my closet for a while now wanting to film this video, but it is very hard to find time to film with a four-month-old and an almost three-year-old. They never want to nap at the same time. Thankfully today I was able to get myself together, get them both down for a nap, and sit down to film. So hopefully we can get through this before one of them wakes up. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with what I picked up at Victoria's Secret. I had gone to the mall because I saw this perfume set that I wanted to pick up from Victoria's Secret. I, I think it's just called Love. It is my new favorite set. Melissa got me, oh, she didn't give it to me. She was actually getting rid of this like rollerball perfume and I took it and I love it. So the scent isn't being discontinued, but they had a lot of their Christmas, their holiday sets on really good sale, but I didn't want to pay shipping. So I figured, let me go in the store and get it there. Unfortunately, they didn't have it, but they did have a few things that I decided to go ahead and grab and I never ended up placing an online order. So no perfume set for me, but that's fine because I got a lot of that scent for Christmas anyway. I just wanted to have some backup. Um, so I picked up this gray t-shirt. It's just a gray v-neck one of my favorite shirts is from victoria's secret i got it at the outlet store in orlando and it is a v-neck that's camo i'm sure you've seen me wear it a million times it is seeing better days and i really need some new t-shirts so i picked this one up and it was on sale let me see so it was originally 29.49 and i got it for 14.75 i actually picked up two of these because the dressing rooms are currently closed so I got this one and a black one and I went over to the bathroom in the mall and tried them both on because I didn't want to have to drive all the way back to the mall to return them if I didn't like them so I did end up returning the black one because it was completely see-through and it just didn't fit me as well so I went with this one size and medium super soft and comfortable and then I picked up some things that I just saw waiting in line to pay. They always get me, man. Oh, and I did get a coupon um, for 20 off a $50 purchase that I totally forgot about. And this is good until March 9th, so I'll definitely have to use that. So I picked up this lip gloss. I was on the fence about this. I saw it, I picked it up, put it down, I picked it up again. I was like, you know what? I think it was $3 if I'm correct. Yeah, it was $3.99 from $12, and I thought, let me just go ahead and get it. It's this really pretty pink lip gloss. Is it gonna focus? There we go. And it is super glittery and I thought oh, maybe it would just be good like on top of another color. And it is a real glittery. I don't know if you guys can even tell but it's very sticky, very glittery. Not my favorite but for three bucks it is what it is. Then I saw this while waiting to pay. This was originally $29.50. It was one of their holiday scents. And I believe I got it for, it must have been $14.75. Or was it $9? I think it was $14.75. Anyway, it is this um, lip set. It has a smooth, soften, plump, and refresh um, different lippies. So I'm going to try this out. I have really bad dry skin and I suffer from dry cracked lips so I thought this would be fun to try out. I'll let you guys know what I think about it. If you have this, let me know your thoughts and opinions. Then I decided to make my way over to Bath & Body Works since it's right across the hall and I have said multiple times that I'm not going to shop at Bath & Body Works anymore. I'm going to the, the all natural products. I use Young Living products and I used to sell Young Living and I still have a link that you can purchase through me. but. I'm not trying to build a business with them anymore. MLNs just are not my thing. And I just 
I don't know, not my thing. Anyway, I have really been enjoying taking baths and even my showers I've been enjoying. It's like my time to just get away and relax. Usually once the kids are in bed, I'll go take a nice warm bath, light my candles, use some fun bath and body products. So I thought I'm gonna go check out what Bath and Body Works has to offer these days. Don't come for me. <laughs> I did still stay away from candles because I think the candles are just too strong for me. They just give me a headache. The scent is just a little too much. I believe most of what I got, if not everything, no. One thing was 50% off, the other two were 75% off. So the first thing I picked up is this. This is the Coco Shea Honey Moisturizing Body Wash. It has coconut butter, shea butter, and pure honey. I actually grabbed this because it reminded me of Melissa, and I thought this would be good to like keep and give to her as a gift, as like part of a gift, um, because she... Melissa means honeybee, and she has um, her honeybee bath bomb company. I don't know, anything bee just reminds me of her. So I picked it up, and I smelled it, and I was like, oh, that's real good. And I have dry skin, and this has lots of good moisturizing properties in it. So I'm going to keep it for myself. So this was $14.50 originally, and I got it for $7.25. So this one was the one that was 50% off. But I'm excited to try it out. It's a pretty large container too. It has 10 fluid ounces in here. So that will definitely last a long time. I picked up this body wash. This is Champagne Toast. And this is not a body scent that I've ever had. But I have used the Champagne Toast candles. And I loved the scent. So I'm hoping I will love this just as much. Oh, it smells really good. This was 75% off. It was $3.37. So can't beat that. I'll just throw that in my shower, try it out. And then last but not least, I picked this up just kind of on a whim. I didn't even smell it because it had a little lock on it and I didn't want to like take it off and you know, you still have to wear a mask and all that. So I didn't want to like go too crazy. But since it was 75% off, I just decided to go ahead and try it. So it is an essential oil mist, stargazing meditation. So you can spray this, it says, Use as an aromatic body mist in the shower or to freshen up your pillows and linens. Avoid spraying directly on face. It is made with bergamot oil, patchouli oil, and vetiver. Vet vetiver oil? Which is like a really calming oil. Um, it does smell good. I did come home and spray David's pillow with it, and he liked it. So I'm going to give this a try. It, like I said, 337 can't beat that. So those are the things that I picked up at the Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Work semi-annual sale. Not too much, but a few things that I thought might be worth sharing. If you guys shop the sale, let me know. Let me know what you picked up. If you guys would like to see more hauls on my channel this year, let me know by leaving a comment in the comment section below. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye everyone.